What is up my friends, welcome back to the channel. Today we have for you guys the 19.30 update and everything new with inside the 19.30 update. Now today's update was actually quite special as we got earthquakes, of course a brand new weather effect. Uh, we also have for you guys brand new skins, the IO drillers will be destroyed soon and so many other crazy stuff. So stay tuned. As a special reminder, every single week we host giveaways to so actually give away skins and V-Bucks. So make sure you guys are in fact subscribed with notifications on and comment down below giveaway for a chance to win of course a skin or V-Bucks bucks during this week so hopping directly into it we have for you guys a 19.30 map and of course we have for you guys some map changes as well as playing uh, in the background video now obviously it does not look that special but if you look a little bit more in depth we can see the io craters have now been updated and of course it looks like this inside the game now what's pretty crazy about the io craters is of course they will also create earthquakes very very soon so stay tuned for that throughout the video as we'll discuss more about that in a few moments but before we get to that point we have for you guys a brand new cosmetics added in the 19.30 update so Here's the brand new NBA All-Star skins. They look pretty fantastic. There'll be a total of five of those. And I believe there'll be also five more skins as far as males. So about 10 skins. Uh, we also have for you guys this in the back of the brand new Monarch skin, which looks absolutely fantastic and will feature two different variants. Alongside that, we got two brand new Toon styles. So we have Toon Bush Ranger and of course Toon uh, basically Peely. And yeah, so it's actually a pretty good lineup, although it's expecting more skins. It's still a pretty awesome lineup. Now the Toon skins will also feature some more brand new stuff, such as this glide in the background video. Now alongside that there will also be a brand new couple of styles for different skins such as Kuno who of course will receive a brand new snow variant and the Elder Rado back bling was now updated to release an item shop very very soon. Now I know a lot of us are thinking wasn't that supposed to be exclusive? Well in the fine print of that actual post it said it would come to the item shop at a later date and well here is that later date so expect uh, the exclusive Elder Rado back bling to no longer be exclusive. And now, finally speaking, as far as the brand new cosmetics, it looks like Gunner, the boss over at Clover Canyon, got some new styles this update. So maybe he might be the upcoming crew pack as far as March. So he looks like he has like almost like a minty style, but it's actually not minty, and a reddish orange looking style. So he could actually very well be the March crew pack, which is absolutely fantastic. And I'm curious to see if you guys actually like this. You know, do you guys actually want to cop this as far as a crew pack? Let me know in the comments below. I think I can make some very, very funny videos as far as content creators. Uh, we also have for you guys a brand new encrypted file. So the gimmick male skin, uh, Rover male, Rover female, Trey Cozy 5 males, Trey Cozy 5 females, and Valentine Fashion female. And I do believe the Valentine skin is actually out right now to the item shop, so definitely enjoy that while you guys actually can. And into our next topic, we also have for you guys, you can now clear all the locker notifications. So that should save you guys a lot of time, especially if you are a person that likes to level up really fast and obtain all these free rewards. It gets very, very annoying to actually go through every single tab to actually get rid of the little three or a little two notification, but this time we can now clear out the entire thing. So save you guys lots of time, which is absolutely fantastic for, of course, going back to playing Fortnite. We also have for you guys, Ford and X Uncharted was also added in today's update. Now, unfortunately, these skins are currently encrypted, but we do have for you guys the actual treasure maps that should be releasing over the next couple of days. So here's that in the background video. looks pretty awesome. Uh, in other news, in case you guys did actually not know this, Credit Mode 2.0 was announced over a year ago. And it looks like today we have for you guys the first official update uh, revolving around the icons for Credit Mode 2.0. So an Unreal icon and essentially like a notification icon saying that something is wrong. So these are actually officially called Creative Mode 2.0 inside the file. So that is our first look at, well, Creative Mode 2.0 mods. Uh, we also have for you guys, these are the first new files related to the zero point in quite some time, and especially during chapter three. And it does actually mention a dark tower. So there should be a huge storyline update uh, coming out very, very soon. And this storyline update will feature something called dark tower. And of course the zero point. I wonder if the Foundation, Paradigm, or of course the actual IO are trying to once again seek out the Zero Point to control the island and the realities. We also have for you guys this crazy update, the IO Drillers will now be felled during the matches, non-competitive of course, they'd absolutely hate that stuff, uh, but here's what they can do. They will actually now create earthquakes while drilling, and if a player is near the drill site, uh, their builds will be damaged and broken. So that's a huge, huge update as far as earthquakes and of course weather changes. 
Uh, in case you guys also not know this, the IO drills will now be completely destroyed at some point, as of course the scientist warns us that, well, the tremors are causing way too much problems. So here's that audio clip from a brand new quest line. I know what you're thinking. Oh, great and powerful scientist. Why haven't you done anything about the drills all over the place? Well, those drills were too small to be causing our seismic complications, but things are more tectonically precarious now. So I need you to destroy them for the safety of the island. Ugh. A quad-core plasma engine. What is this, 1982? Hopefully the island will stabilize. Until then, let's refrain from messing with anything. No drilling or digging or planting flowers. And please... Don't litter. And we also have for you guys some new quest lines revolving around Paradigm now returning and a few other things. So here's the rest of the audio from the challenges. Rocket Launch 3 was a success. I did it. With your help. Tiny Snag, a colleague, embedded a secret message for me in the black box, which would be fine, except the black box fell off. <sighs> She's okay. If this message is accurate, I'm going to need your help again, like, very, very soon. So remember that message from the Rocket's black box? It was from Paradigm. If we're going to pull this off, we're really going to need her help. Well, I'm gonna need her help. I've set up dead drops for her around the island. Your mission is to mark them with space rocks so she can find them. Nice rock placement. Very natural. She'll be able to tell the difference from all the other rocks, right? If I can coax her out of hiding. Oh, you're done. Uh, great. Uh, hey, keep a space rock on me. Thanks very much. She'll have to rewire it. Well, stuff for you guys, upcoming Wild Weeks. So Wild Weeks are definitely returning with Aviation, Assault, uh, Bargain Bin, Mobility, and Baunauza, codenamed Primal. So the Primal Bows will be returning at some point during Wild Weeks, so that's actually pretty fantastic. And I'm sure a lot of us are kind of like, eh, yes, we like bows, but Primal, we absolutely hated that season. So that should be coming back very, very, very soon. Uh, finally speaking, we have already got some more upcoming stuff. That Chapter 2, Season 2 Umbrella item thing was updated. Uh, the upcoming tactical spread now has decreased abilities and a launcher, homing rocket, and missile lock. So the homing rocket launcher uh, could also return very soon as they are currently working on an updated version of that uh, from Chapter 1. So that is pretty much the gist of the brand new 19.30 update, and we hope you guys actually enjoyed it. There will be more content coming up very, very soon, so make sure you guys are fact subscribed with notifications on, and of course, be entered in today's giveaway. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys next time.